I'm high. I'm high right now. I'm on something. I am on whatever they were on when they made that. What's up, my friends? How's it going? Welcome back to my channel. Hope you are doing amazingly well. Uh, today, I'm going to be doing another reaction video because I had so much fun reacting to 90s commercials. So I'm going to keep this vibe going because it's just a very weird experience. So uh, this is going to be another one. This is from a channel called The 90s Kid. Basically, this is just called, Do You Remember These Classic Commercials from the 90s? Uh, more nostalgia, more weirdness. Let's face it, dude, everybody's weird no matter what decade you're in. So today we're just going to focus on the 90s. It'll be interesting. All right, I'm going to shut up and we're going to get into it. Let's do it. Okay, so we're in the late 90s now. I can, I can already tell this is the late 90s. Oh, I remember this one. I love this one. Yes. You gotta. <laughs> hey, where's the cream filling? <laughs> hostess. I love those guys. I love the hostess commercials. So freaking funny. Don't get that, Frank. It could be the office. Yeah, let it rain. <laughs> yeah, definitely late nineties. Extreme stretched angles, like in your face meow, stuff. Meow, I absolutely, I remember all of it. Meow, 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 meow. Oh my god. Oh my god. The meow mix. In fact, it's the only cat food that tastes so good. Cats ask for it by name. Yep. Larry, it's the no place you've ever been in your whole life. Oh, I remember this one. You gotta remember about Disney World is to pace yourself. Yes. No, I, I never saw this commercial on TV, but it was on a VHS tape at the beginning of some movie. I forget what movie it was, but every now and then, like you get a, a VHS tape, you know, of some movie or whatever, and they play like a random commercial at the very beginning, like before all the trailers and stuff. Number three, Goofy is huge. I know he's only this big on TV, but in real life, Goofy could beat up Dad. Yeah. Well, I guess that's all the important stuff. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. You're gonna love this place, Larry. It really brings out the kid in you. I rem oh my There's gosh. Never been a better time to make the wow. dream come true. Wow. We'll be leaving in about three weeks. No, when you buy the oh, that is so weird. Sonic 1, you'll get Sonic 2 absolutely free. Sonic 2 handles stubborn stains. Oh, dude, I need to process that. That was like, that was like, like, I just time traveled. I literally just went back to 1994. And I, I like, I think it was The Mask. I'm pretty sure that was the movie that this commercial was put on the VHS for. Oh my gosh, that's so like, I'm tripping out right now, man. I am, I'm, I'm, my brain is remembering things. <laughs> Oh, that's so weird. So, because like I literally never saw that commercial on TV. The only place I ever saw that commercial was on, on a on a video cassette tape. Okay, all right, got it. All right, focus, 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 Daniel. Do it, focus, Dan. Embarrassing bald spots, no problem. It even slices and dices, <laughs> makes thousands of julienne fries. But wait, you can play it too. This free Sonic 2 is a $54.99 value. You get two Sonics for the price of one. Sonic 2 fits easily into any tackle box. Made from a space-age polymer plastic for years of family fun. And pets love it too. Buy the Sega Gen Genesis that comes with Sonic 1 and get Sonic 2 free. Act now. Wiener dog sweater sold separately. Oh my god. There's a Those Sega commercials were just like another Chia level of trippiness. Chia pets! Soak your tea up. Yep, remember that. Keep it watered and watch it grow. And now mm -hmm. a whole collection. Never had one, but saw these commercials all the time. Kittens, rams, bulls. There's even a chia tree to keep your pets company. Chia pets and trees, the pottery that grows. The chia pet what was it with the 90s and like artificial pets? Yeah, chia pets. Later he had like the, the little little digital things, the Tamagotchis and the nano babies and all that stuff. Yep, remember this. Yep. And totally It's new fruit tonic punch gushers. The fruit snack. How were we not traumatized? So fruity, they'll really 
Maybe that's why we are the way we are. Look, if you want to know why us millennials are the way we are, just look at the advertising, advertising we were exposed to at that age. Oh, the pine saw lady. I remember her. But it's a bargain pine. So? Honey, do you want me to bottles of that bargain pine? It would take to equal the cleaning power on one bottle of pine saw cleaner. She was awesome. Oh, keep going. Three. Nope. Four. More. Five. Five. That's no bargain. You're so smart. Just like your mother. It takes more than pine smell to clean like pine saw. Yeah. Oof. I don't want to grow up. Don't want to grow up. I don't want to grow up. Don't want to grow up. Yep. Yep. I remember this. Oh, I remember that game too! I think I had that. Was that like old Mario or was that Super Mario World? I think that was Super Mario Brothers. Wanna be a Toys R Us kid? Yep. Dude, it's Jeff, Go Jeff Goldblum. He's just always cool. I don't care where he is. He's always. You're afraid, like, are you a computer person? No, I'm not. I'm. I don't like the. That would be like changing my sex or my political affiliation. I'm not. That's a whole new. I'm not that person. Well, there's a computer that makes it so easy. You're up and running in ten minutes, and you're still yourself. You don't have to think about it. You're not talking that language. You have a computer, but you're not a computer person. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh, dude. This is so weird. Uh, first of all, Jeff Goldblum is just like, it doesn't matter where he is or what he's doing, he is always Jeff Goldblum. Like, he is just, he always is who he is. And I respect that. Appreciate you, buddy. Appreciate you, Jeff. Rock on. Rock on for being who you are. <laughs> yep. Remember this one. I remember every single one of these. Yeah. Something's gone wrong in the happy-go-lucky world of Nintendo. <laughs> Introducing Super Smash Brothers, where all your favorite yep. characters go toe-to-toe -to -toe in one four-player star-studded... Oh, Star God, it's like a nine. Nintendo 64. Yes, it's definitely late 90s. That would have been like nine or ten. And you still got that freaking hair. Oh, wait, no, this is early 90s. Mentos, the fresh make. I love that song. I always loved that song. I sang that all the time when I was a kid. It gets stuck in your head. It's so like uplifting. It makes me excited. You know what? I'm gonna make that like my get fired up mix now. Like, if I ever need to uh, a pick me up, I'm just gonna. I'm, I don't even like Mentos. I just like the song. I'm gonna play that song from now on, and it's just, just gonna give me hope. Like something's gonna go better in my life. I didn't even watch the commercial. I was just like getting out, getting enjoying the song. Just oh, oh, that made me happy. That 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 made my day. Thank you, Mentos. Thank you, Mentos. You really are a fresh maker. I love you. Rock on. Keep 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 doing you. Whatever. I don't know. Is mental still? Do people still actually have mental? I don't know. Anyway. Hey, plumber boy, mustache man, your worst nightmare has arrived. Pack up your stuff. I got a little surprise for you here. Check it out. What do you think about that? We got real time, 3D, lush organic environments. How's that make you feel, buddy? Feel a little like your days are numbered? I remember this, but I never played this game. You're hurting my elbow. I never had a PlayStation, that's the thing. Is that Italian? No, Bandicoot. When we, when we moved on from Super Nintendo to, like, the bigger, more three-dimensional ones, I had the choice from PlayStation or Nintendo 64. I went with Nintendo 64. I was a 64 guy. It's an Australian name. Dr. Kravitz? Let's lose that appendix. Okay. <laughs> Oh, 
What happened to a slim Jim? Oh my god. It's sometime in the future. This is why this is it. This is it. This is why us millennials are the way we are. Okay, you want to know why we are the way we are? Look at the advertising. Look at what we were marketed, what we were sold as children. We were sold insanity, and we bought it. And now we've internalized it, and this is who we are. We're all insane. <laughs> it's fun. Crossfire. Never crossfire. Did I crossfire? I don't think I had crossfire. I had something kind of like this, though. Played with it for like a, two weeks. <laughs> Just in case you forgot what it was, it's going to tell you what it is 30 times in the same commercial. Hear that? Bells. School's out. 400 yards. 300 yards. 100 yards. It's hungry, sir. Ah, oh, I remember this. What was this? Yes, okay. Yeah. Beefy. Beefy. Chef Boyardee, beef ravioli. Feed the need. Feed the need, yeah. Okay. How you doing, Sarge? Remember that. Okay, folks, what'll it be? What would you like, sweetheart? A Pepsi, please. Sorry. We oh, a Pepsi girl. Now you've done it. You're sorry? Not half as sorry as you're gonna be. I ordered a Pepsi, pal. She's got a mind of her own. <laughs> yep. Guy. Look, I just thought... You thought? What you really thought was that I don't know the difference between Pepsi and a Coke, right? Here's your Pepsi. Thank you. Oh. Mm. Kids say the darndest things. What are you looking at? I like this place. I want my baby back. Chili, baby back ribs. I want my baby back Chili, baby back ribs. Barbecue sauce. The only thing I actually remember about this jingle is because they sang it on Scrubs. Like, I remember the jingle, but I remember it more from Scrubs than from this. I thought you boys were going to work on the garage. Uh, uh, Dad, we're resting. Yeah. And eating those Apple Jacks, I see. Hey. Kellogg's Apple Jacks. It don't taste like Apple. That isn't why we like them. Then why? <laughs> I know, we just I know. do. We just do. Yep. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> we eat what we like. We eat what we like. Oh, we were so weird. We're down to the last Butterfinger. <laughs> the last Butterfinger. <laughs> Nobody better lay a finger on my Butterfinger. <laughs> Going deep. Get a crispity, crunchity, peanut buttery burst in every bite of Butterfinger. <laughs> Nobody better lay a finger on my Butterfinger. I'm pretty sure my brain has just like a jukebox of all these commercials that are just like stored in there. So like I'm watching this and it's just like that, that little box is just like, you know, trying trying to open. You know, it's like like it's like every single one of these are just ringing some kind of bell somewhere in that little queasing art of my brain. It's, it's just, it's a wild experience, man. If you were, you know, if you're watching and you kind of grew up in the same time, you're probably experiencing the exact same thing. So, <laughs> uh. If your system is the most advanced in the universe, let's review the numbers. Sega Genesis is 16 bits. 3DO is 32 bits. The Atari Jaguar is 64 bits. Which is more advanced? Clifford! Okay, I take it back. I actually don't remember this one. Never mind. I've been proven wrong. No idea. No idea. While see Rex does the limbo. That's crap cheesy bag around it. Cause when the cheese is going to Yeah, I remember this one. That's my cheesy macaroni. Cheesy locomoni. Locomonia. You're a good time here at Tony. You have to pay your pepperoni. Cause when the cheese starts rolling, that gets your noodle. Get your noodle going. Yeah, okay. Good times. Good times. I don't think so. <laughs> Remember that one. DZ. 
I made just for me. A place where I can really I can smell that place watching it right now. I can smell the plastic. I can smell the pizza and I can smell smell the 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 essence of a bunch of very frustrated moms <laughs> who are trying to blow off steam as their kids throw plastic at each other. I can I can literally smell Discovery Zone as I am watching this commercial. I only went there a couple times and I can still smell it. The 90s just smelled like plastic and candy. Like and that's it. That's what they, that's what the 90s. You want to know what the 90s were like? It's pizza and plastic and candy. That's what the 90s were like. Just smell those things, you will be living in the 90s. That's what it's like. <laughs> the 90s made us all just 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 just, just a bunch of <clears throat> That's an awesome place, though. I love DZ. Or... I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah. I've got the cheeseburgers, Carla. Hey, it's Ronald. How you doing, Ronald? Creepy old clown. All of them make it these characters. We were all insane, but some of it was actually pretty funny. Straight. That's straight. Wow. Get Titanic Monday what are you trying to prove, bro? <laughs> listen, listen. Listen, listen, listen. Let me tell you something about Titanic, okay? I freaking love that movie. It was advertised as a love story for, like, you know, middle school and teenage girls and stuff. But overall and all, as a 33-year-old dude, I watch that movie now. It is a gorgeous freaking film. Don't come at me about Titanic. You and me are going to have words, man. Titanic is a freaking masterpiece. Arguably the, ba the last good thing James Cameron ever did. That's just one guy's opinion. Yeah, whatever. Nothing against Avatar. Avatar was fine, but it hasn't aged as well as Titanic. Let's go. Anyway. I can go home. Bath savings are on at Menards. Stop in for super low prices on a wide assortment of Elger bath products. Drop-in sinks are just $36.79. Toilets start at $59. Bring quality in. All these commercials look like they cost $14 to make. The Proline wood sliding door is ready to install with maintenance-free exterior. Now $625. Springtime savings are yours at Menards. Save big money at Menards. Oh, that was fun. That was awesome. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Thank you, the 90s kid. Thank you. I'm going to have to explore more of your content. That's awesome stuff, dude. That is some fun freaking stuff. I feel so trippy right now. I feel very weird. But I, I'm gaining a little bit more understanding as to why I am and why we are the way we are. There, that, There's something profound there. There's some profound thoughts there. You really want to understand a generation? Look at the advertising they grew up on. Look at what they were sold. Look at what they were exposed to. Look at what just drizzled itself into their little lizard jelly brain and how it shaped the weird way they see the world. It's like, wow, dude. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I, I feel like I'm high. I've never even done any kind of like enhancing drugs in my entire life. But I don't, I don't have to. I feel like I don't have to. I just have to watch commercials from the 90s. And I'm high. I'm high right now. I'm on something. I am on whatever they were on when they made that. It's like the, the drugs that they took to make those weird commercials seeped their way through the creativity and through the art and through time and space, through YouTube, out my computer, into my brain once again. And now I am shaking as I was crazy back then. And I'm crazy now. We're all crazy now. Mama, we're all crazy now. Quiet Riot got it right. <laughs> Oh, God help me. God help all of us. God help this generation. 
I mean, I, I'm not anti-millennial. I love my, I love my people. I love my people. I do. But holy wow, <laughs> you want to know what? Th this is it. This is this answers like so many questions, dude. Like I understand us better, kind of. Anyway, that was interesting. That was a lot of fun. I'm gonna go recover. Uh, I need to either watch a, a, a Disney movie or go to a, a Catholic church or go somewhere or just take a walk. I don't know. I don't know. My brain is just doing things. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. But I'm going to go. Hope you have a wonderful day. Take care. God bless. Rock on. And I will see you next time. Peace out.